Yeah, what's up, y'all? So today we at Timurant Island Grill. This is the best Caribbean food you can get in Hunts Vegas. They give you plantains, peas and rice, macaroni, greens. I got jerk chicken because I'm dark skin. Jerk chicken is the best chicken you can get. Period. Are <laughs> oh, you saying peas and rice? These are beans. No, that's what they say. The Caribbeans. Bro, but these are beans though. I know, but they, they say peas and rice for some reason. This is the pure of bean. Y'all put in the comments. Beans are definitely bigger. Let's see what's talking about this time. I ain't, I ain't had this in the last year, but it is January. Though. This is my first time ever eating this place. Uh, so we finna find out what happened for me. Mm. It's still good, just like I remember. This macaroni. Look at this right here. Macaroni. Facts. This is exceptional. Baked macaroni. Exceptional craftsmanship. Mm. The rice was good. Try this macaroni real quick. No cap. Blessing. I could really eat mangoes every day. Like real deal. The curry chicken. Blessing. Oh shit, goat. I think they do got goat. I don't see it on the menu. Oh. Uh, I guess it's maybe limited or something like that. Yeah, we got the collard greens. The colored greens. I don't normally like greens. But I like these greens. These are some good ones. They are, they are. Not the biggest fan, but they're not nasty, so that's a plus. Because most people's greens either nasty or good. Yeah. I really feel that. It's a big difference. It's either eh or it's all the way good. Yeah, but these, these are, they are, I wouldn't say they're all the way good, but they are. Right. I'm not a big fan of collard greens myself, so we... We're in the same boat, bro. <laughs> bro. I only eat them because they're healthy. The best green is, <laughs> is definitely kale. So I, I think it's lettuce. <laughs> We're talking about the ones you cook. Uh, I was going to say, because we use lettuce so often, bro. It got to be good. But you also, like, put anything on it. You don't like the best green that you, like... Freaking, I don't know how people could go like stir fry or or saute, whatever the word is. It definitely gotta be kale. When the last time you had some kale? The like last week. <laughs> I eat kale often. Either I buy it and make it, or I buy it and wait till my mama make it. I had some kale in my um salad the other. I guess it was the other month when I had that salad. It's been a while. I mean, these peas and rice are hitting right now. Shouts out to Tamarind Grill. They gonna get you right. I ain't even touched the jerk chicken yet. So you finna be fighting with that jerk chicken? I cut up. <laughs> got no knife either. <laughs> If you're a first timer, you ain't never tried jerk chicken before, then you gotta be careful. Cause there is some spice to it initially. No effects. And even if it's not your first time, but it, I guess it's been months since you last had it, you gotta be careful still. But if you don't eat spicy stuff like that, watch out. Alright. It's time to go ahead and get into it. Alright, moment of truth. The main dish. Alright, so look at the skin right here. You see that? That's seasoning. <laughs> Think about that. This skin is good, no cap. Watch. Seasoning. And then look at the chicken, still got seasoning on it. Oh! <coughs> <laughs> it's been too long. <laughs> I gotta get a custom to it again. This jerk is good, though, no red cap. I got a jerk on dark skin. <laughs> oh my goodness! I got curry because I'm because it tastes good. I see why I love dried chicken, and because I got dried chicken at the house. <laughs> oh my goodness! 
soul plate. It's exceptional. Off the bone. She can fall in off the bone. It's time for the fast questions. The first question that we have for the Yummer um, is, do they have variety? Come on. Andre? I mean... <laughs> Yes, but um, Tambourine Island Grill, mm -hmm. they have variety. I think so. You see, I got this plate, came with rice and beans, came with macaroni, chicken, their potatoes and the chicken, and came with some collard greens. You no, know, I think that's pretty, that's a lot of variety. That's definitely more than you get at your average restaurant. And some plantains. Oh, yeah, <clears throat> but I don't like plantains, so I give it down. Along with the curry chicken and the potatoes. They had some jerk chicken. I think they had stew chicken, one other chicken plate. There was some vegan chicken, vegan barbecue chicken, vegan uh, curry chicken. There's quite a few options that we got available. Touch. But I had to get the best thing that's on the menu. Question number two, customer service. Was it quick enough for you? Do you feel like they had a, a jolly spirit? I feel like my customer service is gonna be biased. Because I know these people personally, and she's always really nice to me. So, but yes, overall, the customer service was great. Handled us very well. Uh, but yeah, like, this lady knows us personally, so. Same here. Bias. <laughs> I also have a bias pain. That's why we're here. <laughs> this place, I already knew it was delicious. This is my first time, though, so my review's honest. He already knew we, it. Um, I've known the, the, the lady for a while. And the food has been good for a long time. The customer service, she says hi, she talks to me, she knows my name. And she used to work for him? She probably already knows what I want, yes. I used to work for him. It was definitely a good place. Next quick question. Was the food worth the money? This jerk chicken plate was $14. It came with a leg and a, qu a quarter. A big piece, a full bowl, or platter of peas and rice, three plantains, it looks like, macaroni and greens. I feel like that was worth the money. I'm, I'm already almost full, and I'm 6'5". I'm thirsty. <laughs> Food was definitely worth the money. She hooked me up with a large, but the large is 14, the small is 11. Like you see this the large. Pretty sure small is not that much smaller. But definitely, definitely worth the money. Bucks. This place is it. The food came, what was that? Maybe about four minutes? I don't know, I don't keep track of time. I was counting in my head. <laughs> mm. Final question. Yum or um definitely yum. Definitely yum. I'm gonna yeah. be back at this place very soon. Y'all pull up. Yeah, if y'all in the Hunts Vegas area, y'all pull up. If you're in Decatur, pull up. You're not far. If you're in Athens, pull up. You're not far either. If you want some some good Caribbean food, you already know that it's good, pull up at this place. If you're trying to try some new food, pull up at this place. Overall, this was a great eat. I'm not, I actually got two plates right now. I'm gonna eat the rest of this later. Tamarind Island Grill, it is a yum. It's located at the camp for y'all in Huntsville who know what that is. Y'all know it's a great place to be. People coming out here chilling, having concerts and stuff like that. Over by, for y'all who don't know where it's at, it's on University, I don't know the numbers because I live here. But it's by the <laughs> Holiday Inn, the David Busters. You, you see it, it has a big sign that says, the camp so y'all yeah, find it <clears throat> i appreciate y'all for watching and until then i'm gonna start with y'all <laughs>